microbreweries are the big new thing in the business. So far, four or five states in India are allowing them. It started, I think, with Pune, with Maharashtra. Um, Delhi still doesn't have, but Calcutta, Pune, Bangalore, and now Hyderabad uh, allow them. And in Bangalore, for example, they're doing phenomenally well. The Olive Group, which I'm the promoter of, has been looking at this business for a very long time. Uh, but you know, to make good beer, you need a good brewmaster. Like a good restaurant needs a great chef. And that ecosystem wasn't there in India previously. Now the licensing policies are there, there's a framework, there's a maturity, and there's a good ecosystem. So now the company is venturing into its first microbrewery, which is opening here at our Olive property in Hyderabad, in the state of Telangana. Uh, and we're very excited about it. We've created a beautiful space uh, in the last four or five months since the policy was announced and we're getting set to open for business in a couple of days. The secret of a good microbrewery, as I said, is to be making great beer. And our brewery, the Hoppery, as it's called, is working with an Indian who was doing the same business for many years in Singapore. Singapore does great beer and so we had faith in him and we believe that the beer we're making is amongst the best uh, in Hyderabad. Yeah, at any given time in the beginning, we'll serve three, four types of beer. Uh, we really believe in giving the beer time to mature, which is very important. Uh, otherwise, what you're giving your customers is simply inadequate. Uh, that's why we're happy to be working with somebody like Aditya, who is very strict about standards, I'd say at an international level. And I think that we'll be able to give good beer consistently, and that's really what we're about. Over here, this beautiful setting, our great food, the olive hospitality is all a bonus. At the bottom, it's about really good beer. Thank you.